Captain Watanabe. Leave a message. Yuri, where are you? Call me when you get this. I just hope the Devil's Breath is still there. And still secure. If the demons got to that truck, this just went from bad to catastrophic. Missed a call from Doc. Hope he's okay. Peter, I just wanted to... Mark the moment, I suppose. The closing of one chapter in life and the beginning of the next. I couldn't have reached this point without you. And it's my hope that the next phase will only strengthen our partnership and friendship as the world finally sees our work bear fruit. Here's to the future. Huh. He sounds less paranoid than before. Downright hopeful. I hope that means good things are coming. We could all use that. I'm sure it will be something amazing. Nothing terrible at all. Well, the disperser has been left behind. And it looks like it's a bit shattered, but... The devil's breath is gone, but we got yeah. even bigger problems. Rikers? We have to hurry. Hop on. Oh, here we go. Here we what go. Happened? It was a coordinated attack. Must have been planned from the outside. Every cell block is breached. We're minutes away from every prisoner and Rikers walking right up Fifth Avenue. What about the raft? Should be okay. It's a supermax facility. Better security and a separate power grid. Good. What about the Devil's Breath? Sable's handling it. Do you trust them? Do I have a choice? Well, whilst we're busy here, uh -oh. at least Sable's team might be able to slow things down out in the city. And hey, if they don't have a way to disperse the Devil's Breath, that will slow them down for a while as well. Okay. Bunch of hardened criminals. But at the moment, no one with any sort of powers. Oh, <laughs> well, we knocked that guy out. Damn it, they got into the armory. Is that bad? That sounds bad. It means some of the inmates are armed with rocket launchers. Yeah, that's bad. I'm on it. So we knocked that guy out, but as soon as he entered the water, he became conscious again. So he won't just drown. Nice. Where do you guys think you're going? Who thought it was a good idea to bring rockets into a prison? Alright, so I'm going to have to move back and forth on myself a little bit, taking out everyone we come across, as well as making sure none of these guys escape. Sort of stood in the fire a little bit there. <laughs> Bouncing around all over the place. On my way. 
Yeah, sure thing. Okay, everyone else is caged. These guys aren't, though. Someone's trapped behind that door. Okay, well, let's pull this door off and. Oh! They're coming! Where is everybody? They're attacking my car! I guess that guy must have powers or something, he just phase shifted through all the webbing. Oh boy. Let's get to that car pretty quickly. I'll keep working on getting the power restored. Right, I'm on it. Jeez, so many of them. Take them all out. And they're all getting access to specialized weapons. And are you webbed to the car? Yeah, I think the big guy's webbed to the car. He's not going anywhere. Oh, hey buddy. It's all kicking off. Just any time I deal with one group of enemies. It can always get worse. A whole more come to play. Oop, does he have a rocket? Or just a sniper rifle, I think. So let's deal with the snipers and the people with assault rifles. Get them all out the way, especially because they're going to be really dangerous for the cops. Don't want a bunch of stray bullets flying around. Of course they are. Alright, well, we're Spider-Man, so let's web that thing up like a giant fly. Catch it in our web. Or hook it to a truck. <sighs> nice move, Spider. Not as bad as it looks. Okay, well we stopped a prison other. breakout, but uh my experience. When it looks bad, it's usually worse. Look out! But ah! now we're on to the bigger, badder prison. Yuri! I'm flipping! Gotcha. Don't worry. Spidey's here, so you'll be okay. I yeah, stopped the one prison breakout, but unfortunately, there's another prison right next to it. That's host to a bunch of super-powered villains. You okay? Yeah. Welcome to the park! Just in time for the fight! <laughs> yep. Why is he letting everyone out? I'll head for the main control center and see how bad the situation is. Got it. I'll go join the party. Bunch of low-tier super-powered villains. Everyone just quietly go back into your cell and lock the door behind you, okay? Please? I'm gonna you. Low-tier super-powered villains. But luckily, we are still way too much for them to handle, and all their, like, inhibitor collars and things like that, they've been deactivated. Emergency. Emergency. 
so far, however, they're just trying to fight me like normal enemies. They're not launching out streams of fire or, you know, any sort of mutant abilities. They're just weird, different colours and they're just trying to fight me like normal. Okay, up we go. That doesn't sound good. Let's follow Electro. Oh. oh, hi, Rhino. <laughs> Hope you like surprise, Spider. <laughs> yeah, all these villains in one place. What is he talking about? Just a power keg waiting to go off. <laughs> okay, let's just pretend. Let's, let's just go back and let's do that again. And let's just pretend that we're going to do it first time expertly well. I did a web zip when I should have did, uh, should have done a uh, special point-to-point -point web ability like this. There we go. Just pretend hey, I did that first guys. time. Me? Just trapped in a prison with every criminal I put away. <laughs> this is too good to be true. Scorpion, can you hold on a minute? I was in the middle of a phone call and it was business. Well. We've met three supervillains so far. That's half of a Sinister Six. Oh joy. I lost you for a second there. You okay? Not really. Electro, Rhino, and now Scorpion are all on the loose. What's going on in the rest of the prison? Camera system's almost up. I'll give you a sit rep soon. Okay, I'll keep tracking Electro. And let's start using my special suit powers. Oh, hey guys, they were only just starting to break out of their cell and Spider came and just kicked them straight in the head. They didn't even get to participate in the breakout in the slightest manner. Alright, let's keep going. Come on, Spider-Man. I thought this was a chase. Well, I'm being slightly distracted. Imagine having such incredibly technologically advanced armor and then you decide, you know what? I'll keep my chrome dome exposed. Okay, I got the security cameras back online. How's it look? Well, it looks like the entire population of the raft has escaped. Including Bart and me. That makes five of your worst enemies that are now on the loose. <laughs> For a second there, I thought you were serious. I am serious. I have to go. Some of them are heading into the city. Oh boy, a little bit of magnetism in play. We go. Oh boy. Electro, stop. How do you like my new suit? Dashing. Where'd you get it? It's an exclusive club. <laughs> Okay, four on one. I'm sure we'll handle this, no problem. Well, now it's five on one. But still, this is where Spidey excels. 
Incredible agility, such finesse. He said not to kill him. Good idea. In fact, we don't have to do this at all if you don't want to. <laughs> Definitely want to. I can barely commenting at all now. I'm I'm just sat here, mouth agape at the awesomeness. Oh, damn it! Beat down. One hell of a beat down. Hello, Doc Ock. First and final warning. So he's just completely lost it. Stay out of our way. And yeah. From the beginning, Doc Ock was a fan of Spidey's. He Each knew. Each of you has a job to do. Your debts will be repaid when we're done. Go. So now Mr. Negative, who was the big boss for the entire game, and he was the one with the plan, he's now taking orders from Dr. Otto Octavius. There he is. And we're slightly drowning, <laughs> managing to get a breath each time the water level goes down, but uh, yeah, slightly drowning. Oh, damn. Yes, Doc Ock was a fan of ours from the very beginning. He knew that we were a good guy trying to help out the city. So, he at least gave us a warning to not go up against him. But next time, he's probably going to kill us. And yeah, Doc Ock has just gone insanely mad. This is his big plan to get revenge against Norman. Release a bunch of supervillains. Onto the city. All these years. Oh, Christ. All these lies. It's over, Norman. Time to give them the truth. What is the crazy play here? He, he, he's just gassing everyone. Yeah, I'm supremely surprised by the turn this took. I thought Martin Lee was going to get his hands on the Devil's Breath again, but no, Doc Ock, he's just decided... I mean, well, he hasn't really decided anything, he's just gone absolutely mental. Like, I thought we'd be fighting against him as he's trying to get revenge just on Norman Osborn, but nope. He's pulling all sorts of crazy plans. Alright, 24 hours later, after our brutal beatdown. Oh, hell. Hey, you okay? Yeah, fine. Can you, uh... Can you pass us out for me? Sure. But they are working around the clock on a cure for this deadly disease. The citywide quarantine is being heavily... Yeah, and it's citywide. It's not just that crowd that were at the Osborne rally. Throughout the city, police and stable agents continue to battle with Rikers and Raft escapees. Meanwhile, Mayor Osborne has gone on record blaming Spider-Man for the prison break and citywide sickness, and branding him a fugitive. You moron, Osborne. Citywide pandemic. Everyone's in danger. Not just the people at the Osborne rally. Everyone. I, I 
can't believe that this is what Doc Ock has decided to do. Like, this is how to bring Norman down. As well as millions upon millions of innocent people. And yeah, so far throughout the entire game, Why? all of these cutscenes and everything, we've been seeing whatever costume we've decided on. They said you went AWOL. I need to get back to work. The doctor said you still have 14 broken bones. Which means I have 192 non-broken ones. Thanks for taking care of me, by the way. The hard part was keeping you hidden from Samus. They branded you a priority target, you know. I humbly accept the honor. What is happening to our city, Yuri? I don't know. Feels like the end of the world. Maybe it is. Jeez. Just look at... everything. I'm here to help. Good. There's gangs of escaped prisoners banding together and taking over entire city blocks. Looting, strong-arming local residents, you name it. I'll take care of them. What else you got? The mayor told Silver Sable to do whatever it takes to find Lee and Octavius. So she's just rounding people up indiscriminately, holding them captive in bases around the city. I've even heard rumors of enhanced interrogation tactics. You mean torture? 